Yo, what's going on guys? DJ Hess here, CollectiveKicks.com. Wanted to bring you guys a Nike Factory Store deals video that I ended up picking up uh, from the Factory Store. And the price point of these, I just couldn't pass up on them. I do already own a pair of these, but I figured the double up would have been worth it. And without further ado, I'll show you guys when I'm going to pick it up. Um, and uh, shout out to the Shoeseum. Uh, I ended up going with him. And actually, he had the 30% off coupon uh, in his hands. And he ended up uh, hooking me up. So these ended up being a total of... And I'll show you the, the thing right here, like, so you can see. 55, and then minus uh, the 1650, so hard to see, like, right here, but uh, let's see, there you go. It's 3847, so anyways, I'll show you guys what I ended up picking up. I ended up getting a pair of Nike SBs, and they are the De La Soul Dunks. And these things are definitely dope in my opinion. The downside is quality on these were mediocre. Obviously, that has that McDonald's leather on it. Nothing super fancy. But I love the concept of the De La Soul Dunks. De La Soul is, is the hip-hop group. If you guys did not know that, um, back in the day, De La Soul uh, was like pretty popular in like the 90s and whatnot. And um, this is kind of some album, album cover like artwork. Um, that they kind of hot like just mix and match and kind of put them on the upper um, But the other part of these is obviously ten years ago uh, Nike SB and De La Soul did a collaboration and they did the low top version with this pattern And then they did the high top version with the brown and green pattern um, And so this was a reverse of the De La Soul dunks from ten years ago So the high top the low top back then is now the high top the high top back then is now the low top and I have both of them already I have the low top and the high top of this year, but I don't have the original ones from 10 years ago. So that's kind of a little history on the shoes. Uh, I don't think this this generation really understood the De La Soul Dunks. And also the release of these happened over another big, uh, I think, Jordan release. So it was kind of like one of those ones where they just, they just didn't get very much shine. Um, but at the end of the day, when you see them at factory stores, and you can see it says right here, Nike Dunk High PRM for premium, DLS for De La Soul, SB Skateboarding, QS, uh, quick strike so it's a huge amount of stuff going on here um, end of the day it was 150 retail then they were $90 at the, at the outlets and then they were 55 bucks 55 with a 30% off was $38 and again shout out to the shoeseum because he gave me his 30% off or one of his 30% off uh, fa friends and family um, deal things and I ended up uh, shopping around with him uh, while I was there so it's kind of fun I have a different video that I'll be posting on on the kind of the shopping stuff there was a whole bunch of stuff at the Nike factory store for 30% off. The entire store was 30% off. So there was tech fleece deals and even Jordan retros there uh, that, that were there that were 91 or $92 uh, for some of the retros that are usually $190. So pretty crazy. But at the end of the day, this is what I walked home with. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. And for me, it was like definitely like I had to do it like for anything like 50 bucks even is a, is a great price for these. Considering I paid 150 for the original pair that I already have in my collection. Uh, this price was it was definitely dope to be able to pay $38 for a pair. So that's pretty much it. If you guys are interested in buying a pair of these, check the link in the description to eBay. And have a good day. Thanks for watching. Peace, guys.